Jason. Then I come. Ah, ah, ah. Try to get some movie. Whoa, whoa. Good. The hell that was? Oh, whoa. Water fishing. <laughs> Join me, guys, you won't regret. Today we are going shallow, really shallow. What treasures shallow waters hide? We are about to find out. Hey, guys, today we are going to see the new Surf Walker, the second version, that is going to blow your mind. Why? Let's find out. Whoa. What you will notice immediately, compared with the previous version, is the casting distance. It casts at least 20% farther. And that's something we all need, especially salt water, right? Then you will find out that it has a more enhanced uh, walk the dog action and it's super easy to use. Let's try to get some fish, shall we? So we are in a river mouth. The sea around us comes very calm and we are going to try to get some blue fish. We know that there are some needlefish around. So what better than a floating lure that casts like a bullet and has a needlefish appearance. Let's see. I will use the electric motor to stay in the shallow and cast far. Hmm. Tough decision. I will start with Sayori's GD, a perfect needlefish imitation. Bluefish are powerful predators. But sometimes they can be tricky. You have to fool them. And once you do, then the real trouble starts. <laughs> Today, with so calm conditions, I'm going to use mostly the floating uh, model. As you are going to see, it's more than enough. Since my targets are bluefish, I'm going to skip surf walker on the surface. This will probably will get their attention and make them attack. Here you can see how nicely Surf Walker skips on the surface. The combination of walking and skipping fast usually is very effective on bluefish. Bluefish are very aggressive fish. Sometimes you really need to trigger them. And fast action on the surface is the key to success. Okay, two. It's a nice size. <laughs> Fighting a bluefish in less than one meter of water is a true challenge. 
Oh, it's very well hooked. Look how smart it is, huh? Wait, wait, we have to tire it. A nice bluefish can easily put you in trouble. If this wasn't enough I... to break my SGS6 rod, nothing is. Yes. Oh. Okay. It's tired, but wait, 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 wait. Put it in the water. I will guide the fish. Oh. Whoa! 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 Oh. It it lost one one uh, one treble is off, but it's tired. Be careful. Even a tired bluefish is hard to get in the net. You need speed and skills. Part. <laughs> Once in the net, the bluefish stop fighting. Sayoris <laughs> GD did an excellent job. It looks so much like a little fish. But the fish scratched it. Uh. I will release this beautiful fish, okay. but not in the position that I'm fishing, for obvious reasons. Bye bye. So, we have three sizes of surf walkers, the second version, and uh, two sink ratios, one floating and one sinking. Uh, the difference is, the floating versions are made to do more subtle movements. You can use them with skipping, exactly as you would do with a sinking uh, uh, surface lure, but you can also use it dead slow, walk the dog, and also normal walk the dog and of course skipping the sinking version is for more aggressive uh, action so you will use it with uh, aggressive skipping or aggressive walk the dog <laughs> aggressive action always worked in very aggressive species like the bluefish watch oh you come Oh. Alex, we should put it fast in the net to release it unharmed. So we have to make it tired first. It's a very strong opponent. And they love the surf walker. The second edition. Whoa! Oh. It has both trebles inside, eh? Whoa. Whoa! Be careful. I will try to lift his the head up. Whoa! It's crazy! Ah. Whoa. Not, not, not on the trolling motor! The fish gets furious and my body hasn't opened properly the net. Okay. Again in. I suggest before any attempt of netting, guys make the fish tired and this fish won't get tired easily okay who's tired when bluefish see the net they become very angry try to use crystal clear nets another big one another big one another monstrous fish Oh, and it's, uh, look, it's bitten, it's missing a fin. Oh, 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 oh. Talk about a big one. 
Something that you are going to notice is that the two trebles on the rear part are very close to each other. Simply because the lure, the first half is outside and slapping the surface. The two hooks are very close, so in case of a strike, they will hook both securely the fish. That's the reason. Another new aspect are the three dots that are UV red, like bite marks. It seems that they attract the strike close to them and the two trebles are waiting for it. Another aspect are the new steps under the butt that they make uh, micro vibrations and they hold a bit better the butt during skipping. Despite the muddy waters, fish today seem to love more natural colors. Usually they love strong colors, white, white, yellow, but today they prefer uh, normal colors. Probably because actual uh, needlefish are around the area. Hmm. Let's try the mullet color for a change. Whoa! Yeah. Whoa! Oh, oh, Lisa! <laughs> Oh, 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 a needlefish, a very big needlefish, <laughs> huge needlefish, whoa, huge needlefish, <laughs> insane, huge needlefish, <laughs> now uh, a bluefish comes and take it and I will cry, come here needlefish, whoa, that beast was able to pull drugs, dress set for bluefish, whoa. crazy, huge needlefish, <laughs> Whoa! Oh, no, 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 What's this, man? Look at the size! <laughs> Insane size! <laughs> It's not our, uh, it's not our, uh... wait, yeah, wait, from the head, from the, always from the head, <laughs> the, the size is, look, whoa, <laughs> monstrous, it's huge, and it, I got it from the butt that made more interesting the fight, but it's huge, <laughs> huge. So the needlefish had a reason being here, and the bluefish have a reason to hunt needlefish, huh? So which rod I'm going to use? Something extremely convenient for this type of fishing. I'm going to use the SGS6 1242 grams, the all round that uh, is made for <laughs> inshore fishing but also offshore fishing due to the perfect length it has this rod is 2.51 meters and that makes it perfect for uh, offshore spinning for real i prefer to use the sg8 4000h that has a very nice uh, performance and also a high gear uh, retrieve that helps me control perfectly my top water lures. So, there are mullets in the river and uh, needlefish in the river mouth. So, <laughs> serve walker 180 with a shape of a needlefish and uh, the colors of a mullet can't fail. Casting with Surf Walker version 2 is a dream. <laughs> if you haven't tried, you have to. You won't believe the casting distance. And sometimes all you have to do is make them angry. 
Skip it! Put it down. A monster fish. Huge. Huge. started to be lazy. They don't respond to our uh, efforts to come on uh, the surface. We have to find another way. Maybe change uh, walking style. Bluefish are escape artists. They jump, they go back, they, they do everything to speed. And they have so strong jaws that even if you set the hook continuously, they can find a way to spit it. <laughs> Watch this. Whoa. The dog. Oh. Slow walk the dog. Yes. <clears throat> yes. Slow walk the dog. Look how many they are. Oh, look at them, look at them. Hmm. This wanted slow walk the dog. Oh, two, two hooks in the mouth. That's exactly what I was talking about. Okay. Another big one. Whoa! <laughs> and it left. Anyway, it was going to be released. Look at the scars, guys. Look at the scars. That was a win, at least. <laughs> awesome. Awesome. It saved me from the trouble to net it and release it. As you saw, these fish attacked in Walk the Dog, not skipping. They were lazy, so we had to find another way to trick them. You will find some colors that are amazing. You will love them.
that's all folks if you enjoyed this video subscribe as i promised more cool stuff are coming and more will come stay tuned stay safe and uh, see you soon bye